Okay, so once Eraser has installed itself, it adds to the context options menu that pops up when you right click on a file. So in this uh, first video for the Eraser, de Eraser demo, we're going to um, walk through that process. So I'm going to open up the Windows Explorer and you can see that there's a Word document in here and we're assuming this is an outline from a paper I wrote and we're going to pretend that it contains data of some value. So we click on it, right click, and we go down to Eraser Secure Move. This allows me to move this file to another folder and, and be confident that the data in an original location is no longer available. So I'm going to click and I'm going to click the folder, Save Folder, and when this window pops up you have the ability to go to Options and go from the default, which is a single pseudo data overwrite, pseudo random data overwrite, to one of the more uh, comprehensive overwrites. So if you have to be in compliance with DOD standards, for example, that is in here. However, for most business applications, a single overwrite is sufficient. There are many attackers that are going to take the time uh, to try to uh, put together all the sophisticated information that's required to grab this data. Um, or grab your PII or your EPHI or um, your standard intellectual property. So I'm going to click OK. I'm going to click Yes. I'll pop the erasing report. This is optional as part of the, it's by default after the install. This comes up, but in the general options within the uh, eraser console, you can turn this off. It shows that the file was deleted and written to a no location. So I'm going to close this. And to erase, uh, it's very simple. Simply go to the Save folder, click Erase. I'm going to leave my default options, yes, and it shows that it was erased. Uh, by the way, I can save this so that I can have a record of erasing the file, but I choose not to in this case. Hit Close. And that's how you erase or move a file, a single file, with 